There are so many community building platforms out there for creators. A lot of them have very similar tools and features. So how are you supposed to know which one is right for your community? We're going to compare two different platforms on the market today and hopefully help you figure that out. NASIO and Circle. NASIO is specifically designed to host and manage communities while offering pre-made content to share with your members. It's mainly for content creators, but also appeals to bigger brands and businesses. Circle is a community building platform for creators and brands alike. So what sets these two apart? First, let's take a look at pricing. NASIO has a free membership option for smaller communities. It includes all of these features under the beginner section, while also allowing you to host events, upload content, message your members, along with chat support available for you 24 seven. Even with the free option, you can charge a subscription fee and monetize your community. Then if you wanna go pro, it's $49 a month. The pro membership gives you more storage to upload your own content, along with added features that are helpful as you grow your community. As for bigger businesses and brands, you can negotiate the perfect plan for you directly with the NASIO team. The platform fee is also 3.5% whether you are on a free or paid membership. Now let's take a look at Circle. Their memberships begin at $39 a month for the beginner's option and their transaction fee starts at 4% and reduces the higher your tier of membership. There is no free option to circle, but they do offer a free 14-day trial. And if you decide to pay annually, you can save a decent amount of money. Now, their beginner's membership offers all of these core features plus 10 gigs of storage upfront, basic email support, and a maximum of 1,000 members. If you want more features, you have to upgrade to their pro plan at $99 a month. And with this, you can get 10 times more storage, 10,000 members, plus options for coding, live streaming, courses, and advanced analytics. So if you want to do anything significant with your community, it looks like you would need to go with the professional option. But if you want a basic, simple community experience, the beginner's plan should work fine. Then there's the business option for $399 a month. Next, let's look at how easy these are to set up. NASIO prides themselves on their easy setup. It takes just two clicks and five minutes of your time. You can customize your domain for SEO and for your personal brand. And don't worry, you don't need to know anything about tech. When you start setting up your community, you start by giving your community a name. Next, you connect it to a chat platform and you're done. You can start inviting people to your community right away. NASIO also has tech support available 24 seven through an instant chat if you need help. Circle has also made setup very simple. When you set up your community, you have to prep two spaces, your post space and your event space. Posts are where members talk and post content, and the events page is where your members can look through upcoming events and RSVP. You also have the option to set up as many spaces as you like and customize the access to the rest of your community. So while NASIO prides themselves on simple setup, Circle seems to be a bit more customizable. Now let's look at events and live streaming. NASIO lets you host events for free with unlimited guests. For hosting events or live streams, NASIO integrates with video and streaming platforms like Zoom and Discord. And members can add the events directly to their Google Calendar. This makes it super simple to manage. You also don't need to worry about having an account for these apps. All you need is a NASIO subscription. They also give you email invite templates and they send them using their unique magic reach tool, which we'll talk about later. For Circle, you can host events and even charge a ticket fee to earn extra revenue, but you can only host live streams if you are paying for the professional or business plans. You can also pay for add-ons like extra hosts or attendees for an additional monthly fee. Next, let's look at communication. NASIO has built their own special feature called the Magic Reach Tool. The Magic Reach Tool helps you send out your communication through whatever channel is best for each individual member. This means you don't have to pay for other communication tools like MailChimp, for example, when you want to send a message. Instead of your message always going through email like it would with MailChimp, the Magic Reach Tool finds the best channel to reach each individual member, whether that be through email, SMS, or WhatsApp chats. This means that every 
every single time, you will reach your members in the most effective way possible. Circle's communication model is a bit different, and what they have over NASIO is their in-platform chat. With NASIO, you can only chat through integrated apps like Discord or WhatsApp. Circle, however, has a built-in chat directly in the platform, meaning no integrations required. Now let's take a look at courses and content. If you have your own course content you want to share, you can simply upload those class videos to your library, name the files, and then share it with your members on NASIO. You can upload other resources such as links or PDFs. You can also get a landing page for the course. You just get the URL and you can share it with your community. This way you can drive people to your community through your course. Circle has its own space for courses, just as it does for posts and events. It also lets you upload your course videos like NASIO, but they're also working towards letting you create audio files, text blocks, and the option for viewers to comment directly on the course video, enhancing the community learning experience. You can also create a customized course page and choose whether or not you want the course to be private or not. And if you want, you can link the course to a paywall and charge a fee to access the content. In terms of analytics, NASIO has a ton of different analytics tools for monitoring engagement, reach, and the health of your community. It's all under the analytics tab. You can do your own analysis, but if you hate that stuff, don't worry. Each week, NASIO will send you a weekly roundup to summarize your analytics and it will give you some suggestions on how to improve your community. It removes any guesswork by highlighting weak spots in your community so you don't have to do anything. Circle also gives you access to analytics. However, you unlock more advanced analytics once you upgrade to the professional option. You can also only export an analytics report if you contact Circle directly. So what's the consensus? Both of these platforms are great if you want to begin a small community or a large community. However, NASA gives more options for free than Circle does with their basic plan. However, if you want a more customizable experience for a larger community, Circle might be your best bet. Your best choice is dependent on what your budget is and how customizable you need your community to be. Hopefully this helped you figure out which platform best suits your community. Let us know in the comments if you have any suggestions or other platforms you want us to compare. See you next time.